I think Mark Benet was very sincere in his comments, and I've been talking to him over the last several weeks. And so I, I know that there's a good uh, continued spirit of cooperation between the Raiders organization and UNLV and, and the folks on the stadium authority board. So I've got, I've got no concerns about how this is going to work out in terms of our use of the stadium. No, I'm, I'm confident that, that we're still going to build this NFL ready, uh, ready dome stadium. Uh, talked with folks from the Sands organization just within the last week, and, and uh, they, they let me know that they're still very supportive of this project going forward and UNLV being, UNLV being a part of it. But we're going to get what we want. We want a game day experience and a home field advantage, and that has all kinds of elements associated with it, with, with markings inside the building and on the field and outside the building, and a lot of the things that we get to do with our alumni uh, as we you know, do pregame activities. And so everybody, including the Raiders, have been assuring us that that's all going to still be there. We're absolutely confident that if it comes to the Collegiate Stadium, option that we've come up with the 200 million. You have to you know, realize a lot of thought went into that bill and that particular language in the bill around the private funding that it would take to come up with the 200 million. It doesn't have to be just philanthropic funding. That can come from naming rights and all other sponsorships plus philanthropic support. We could pre-sell seats and suites. We could do bonding off of all that activity. And so there are a lot of ways that we can come up with the 200 million and I'm confident we'll be able to do it if it comes to that. But let me say, I'd rather have the large NFL Ready Dome Stadium. I think it's better for everybody. Are but you preparing to upgrade Sam Boyd to where the Raiders could play home games there while the stadium's being built? We're, pre we're prepared to do that if, if asked. Um, you know, it's, there's a chance that you know, if the stadium built in, in 2020, it looks like they've still got a couple more years on their on their lease of the stadium up in Oakland. There may be a year there where they need a place to play, and so we're prepared that if we need to do something, we'll work with them to make that stadium ready.